Antigonus, 1400 meters, sent on their way. The Bayou was slow a length with Lady Serena second to last for the first 200 meters. On the inside, Congo Compact, fleet footed out the gate by a half, Antigonus at the quarters second. Prince of Taranto's on the outside, hard held, so too Master of Destiny, indicating the pace is not too hot. Lady Serena sits towards the inside, and towards the outside is the Bayou. Calling the shots in front, Congo compact by a length. Antigonus sits quietly in second as they go to the 700 meter marker. Master of Destiny, more relaxed now in third, so too Prince of Taranto. Two lengths, Lady Serena, the Bayou. About to be homeward bound, 600 to go, Congo compact, been there throughout. On the right hand side, Antigonus will be the first one to throw down the challenge. Master of Destiny, Prince of Taranto, blue sleeves and cap to the outside. The Bayou's trying to get into it. Antigonus now pours on the pressure. Master of Destiny, the white caps on the inside. Prince of Taranto to the outside. Antigonus hit the front. Prince of Taranto is trying to wear down. Antigonus drifting to the inside. And that allows Prince of Taranto to inhale them. Prince of Taranto from Antigonus. Master of Destiny and Congo Compact. Antigonus moved up dangerously and then lugged right to the inside and Prince of Taranto takes it with both hands. Antigonus moved up, hit the front and then started to lug to the inside all the while number seven Prince of Taranto was finding top stride. For the Revors, Butchers, Main Gods, Nyrax, Ribelins, Clifton Stud Brett, Tony Ribelin. Serena Mudley picked up the ride. Master of Destiny, third, Congo Compact, the Bayou. Well, when Antigonus hit the front, looked like this individual, the son of Crusade, would skate away. Prince of Taranto was charging on the grandstand side. And now you'll see Antigonus wants to lug to the inside. Prince of Taranto's in full cry. Antigonus drifting right to the inside. Prince of Taranto also seems to drift away from the outside rail, but he comes home best of all. Well, uh, Prince of Taranto, Tony Riverland teaming up with Sereno Moodley. Uh, well done to Clifton Stud, uh, the breeders. Uh, congratulations, guys up at Clifton, uh, son of Crusade. Uh, that's uh, Peter and Jenny. And of course, to all the uh, owners here, Ravel, Butcher, Main Guard, Nyrak, Riverland and Riverland. I see the Riverlands involved with this horse, now notching up his third career win. And I love the groom's name. Really love it. Chikalele. Chikalele. Hey, my man. <laughs> 1,000 rand, Hollywood Pets and Gold Circle. Congratulations. Your horse has done a wonderful job for you here today. Yeah. Chikalele. Thank you, thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Okay, let's get Tony in, Tony. Firstly, uh, you know, thanks for the comments. We had a brief chat and you did have a, a slight scare this morning, but you decided all's well. I'm going to run the horse because... Uh, on ability, you thought, uh, you know, against this type of field, he'll hold his own. You know, geez, I was so confident um, when all these horses were scratched. Um, not that there were that many of the fancied horses scratched. I thought he's definitely the best horse in this field. He's met stronger. Short. Last time he found interference in running, the time before it didn't go his way. But he's not an easy horse to ride. And um, But once the field cut up, I knew he'd be in the right place. I opted actually early in the week to take the blinkers off because he'd only run at Scottsville once. And... Um, was his only bad run of his life. Anton rode him and said he didn't know where he was. He was just all over the place. And last time he traveled over, raced slightly with the blinkers on, I thought he doesn't need them. He knows what's going on. But he gave me a bit of a scare the last two days. He's left a bit of food, been very flat in an abnormally low temperature this morning. And I must say, you know, you start, you think the horse is going to win and then you have these curved balls they throw you. But I must say he perked up on the way to the start and that made me happy. And, um, He's been a nice horse for us, I must say. Well done to Clifton Stud. It's great that I could give um, Robert Maingard a winner as well, an old friend of mine, Michelle, of course. 
and Patrick, my cousin, and um, yeah, it's great to have a winner, so um, I'm pleased. Well done, Tony. Great job with the sauce. Uh, anything else left? You got, I think, Cupid's left? Yeah, we've got Cupid's song in the next. He's working really well, Dees. Um, he sometimes flatters to deceive. Sean's pretty confident. We'll see. Thanks a lot for that, Thank Tony. You. All the best. So, you know, great ride. It was a small field. You know, sometimes it's, it's, you know, things can go not as planned. But you, you found yourself towards the back of the field and making up the ground. Yes, definitely. These, you know, is that type of horse that only enjoys one running style and that's it. You know, you have to drop him in and uh, he accelerates later on, you know. And uh, look, I'm just glad today I thought he was the right horse in the race back on the poly. You know, when I won on him, he was on the poly track. So I was half Mr. Rivlin as soon as I saw Smanga get off and uh, I said, please could I ride the horse again. And you know, I must thank Mr. Rivlin for that. I'm truly grateful for the opportunity to all the owners are here today. Massive thanks to them. The top way to add the claim two and a half. Rachel rode a clever race when she skipped uh, and she seemed to skip at the right time. but. Her horse started wobbling around. Yes, definitely. You know, she, she probably pulled the right move. And uh, look, I know the horse can knuckle down at the end. And uh, he's got a tremendous turn of foot from the 200. And uh, he just he did just that. And I'm just glad, you know, it paid off for me today. And uh, once again, massive thanks to Mr. Rowland and his whole team. Fair to say he took some riding? Yes, definitely. He made me work, but I always knew he was going to give it to me. So he made hard work, work of it. But I'm just glad he, he could have got up today. Any immediate targets for 2022? How you want to end up the season? We've got six months left. Look, these obviously try and ride as many winners as I possibly can. You know, I'm just grateful for all the owners and trainers out there for the opportunities. And I just look, I want to get more winners for the season. And I'm just going to be trying hard this season. Nice ride, yeah. Thanks, these A massive thanks to my sponsors winning form as well. OK, who's going to represent the guys? Uh, OK, we've got uh, Tony's uh, cousin coming through. And uh, well played. Well done. The horse has done you proud again. Again, thanks, Dees. Yes, he's a, he's a little... I love him to bits. He's a wonderful little horse. I think this was his 11th run and he's won three now, so he can't complain about that. And I think only one run in Maritzburg where he, he just didn't like it. But otherwise, he's always been there or thereabouts. So very, very happy. Thank you. Uh, other horses in training, how, how's the luck there? Not too bad. I've, got, I've just got three with, with, with Tony. Um, Victory Twist, who ran third last week and won in December. So I'm on a bit of a he's run at the moment. He's in good form, that horse. Yes, he's, he's also a good little horse. So, well, not little, he's got a big horse, but he can run. So. And then I've got a baby, still in, just a two-year-old, so still coming through. But uh, just want to say thanks to Tony and Terry and Bo and the whole team at Rivalin Racing. Um, to my fellow owners, um, thank you very much for letting me take a share in this horse. It's, it's, it's going well so far, so I can't complain. And Serena had a really nice race, and this is two out of the three wins I've been with him. So, sure. so I think he gets on well with him. And then we, we never know where from here. I mean, he's, he's still young, and he's, he's, I think he's, he can still win a couple more for us. So um, it's really exciting. Well, all the best to yourself and the rest of the guys, and all the best for 2022 as well. Thank you, Dees. Thanks, and same to everybody well, else. Thank well you. played to all the winning connections you have. Number seven, Prince of Taranto. That's one race number four.